Hello everybody. So today we are going to see how to create a simple CSS drop-down menu. So first HTML, great. Drop-down menu, and I need some styles. So you know, style, and I need an ordered list. With a couple of LA elements, and you know, within that, I need anchor tag. I'll name this as one, and I'm going to copy this a couple of times. Great. And now I need a nested an ordered list within our li element so then that i need list items and you know we we'll call this option one i'm going to copy this again for a couple of times so this is going to be option two and option three all right so let's view this thing in browser first i have that here saved in desktop so okay uh, you guys can see here we have two unordered lists nested and first we need to remove these bullets and margin here in left so let's do that now okay for that first i'm going to create a class here called drop and we're going to target this now using ul.drop list style type equal to none let's view this first mm, yeah let's go on now we got to you know remove that margin in left side and also some padding so back here uh, I'm going to give margin zero pixel and adding zero again okay uh, this should work fine okay they are all gone but we have a problem here this nested you know an ordered list it didn't take any effect so let's target that now so for that I'm going to do ul dot drop Align again UL. So that's going to be yeah list style type nothing and I want margin zero padding zero pixel fine. So now okay they are all aligned in left now. Uh, now I want this you know main menu one two and three to be floated to left in horizontal position let's do that now so for that uh, okay that should be a draw li I've got to give this as float left I guess so let's try that now yeah you can see here they all floated left but we have problem that is nested unordered list we don't want that to float left we want that stack one after another downwards so for that uh, 
could do something like ul drop li ul ligand li float none let's view that first okay that's done and now uh, I want to style these things you know I want to first remove this underline in anchor tag and some background color we'll see so we're going to you know you will draw anchor and I'm going to do this decoration it's none right and I want that no uh, we'll do one thing first we will go for background color background here I want that to be black and here this text color on color to be white let's try this now okay all right you can see that uh, now I want all this to be center line this top menu so I'll do here text line center okay now I want some padding in there let's try it now adding I'll give top and bottom 5 pixel and 20 pixel to right and left all right that works but you should see here uh, all the changes are affected here in this options so we have to fix that now so what we do here is uh, I want this yeah here text align be left let's see okay that's not change. going to have any effect <coughs> should be text align left all right I'll come to that uh, yeah you know what this ul element it should be absolute position absolute. okay you can see here now they're okay and let's have some border you know i want some lines here so we'll have border right right solid one pixel and that was supposed to be white okay we got that here uh, but the problem is you can see here it got affected right here in this nested list so for that here border right we give none and border top solid you know, one pixel again that's going to be white all right yeah now you can see a problem here you can see some space here right and right here as well this uh, and that happened because we give padding here you know five in top and so how do we fix that uh, 
you could do that by you know here so you say margin top 5 pixel and margin left that's minus 20 right it has to go back all right that works uh, but we had to give that in ul not li right Okay, it still got some problem here. Uh, what was that? Here. All right. Typo. Okay. Now, um, you know, when we hover here, I want this background color to be changed. So for that, this li here. I'll copy this and when we hover over this li I want background to be something like gray right let's try that okay you can see here it's working and I want okay that looks cool and now here is the thing about drop down all you had to do is hide this ul element this option one two three it is in one nested ul element and not at least you just had to hide that and when you hover here you just had to make them appear so how we do that is you know what uh that is that ul element yeah we have that here right so i'll give this display now let's try that okay it's gone right now yeah when you hover over this element which is you know first layer of an ordered list and that will be this part right yeah here la element so the way we achieve this is when we hover over that element Mm, the ul next to that that you had to bring back right so that will be display block let's try that okay it's all working fine okay and okay this will work in almost all browsers uh, but we could give some css property have here i don't want to type all that you know what i'm just making this edges rounded this is going to be some rounded corners you can see here this nested li right first ul li then again nested ul nested li first child you're going to give top left and top right as five pixel then here bam yeah you know last child I'm going to give bottom left and bottom right to five pixels that's all so let's try this yeah you can see here uh likewise you could do for you know this side as well let's try that out uh it has to be okay we have to remove this whole section here right no okay first child and right so it has to be top left top right ah uh, no it has to be bottom left right top left and yeah it has to be bottom left it's 
So this is going to be bottom left. Okay, and here this last element it should be recall top right and bottom right, right? So it's top right, bottom right. Going to be right. Okay, you can see here. But this, you know, CSS3 property and this is not going to work on older browsers. But rest of the things works just fine. Anyway, thank you for your time, guys. I'll see you next video.